Nature into Art by Thomas Christopher. So, photographs by Nigok Min Nigu Nigo Nigo. I just screwed up your name. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, so it's uh, about the gardens uh, of Wave Hill. So and it's divided into the different gardens sections. So you got the flower garden, the gold border, um, the shade border, the wild garden. Um, wave Hill through the seasons. Um, so I have more screenshots for my previous video. So you do get a variety of like photographs, like both old and new of the garden within the information you get like stuff like that so you do get um a history and a snapshot of each garden throughout like its design process to what it is today so And and like with the images of the plants and flowers, you do get the name of it. Um, if you do like it in the photographs, you can have a look at it further. Um, each garden has its own section, like I said, from reading off the table of contents. Um, there's some information about the flowers or plant, um, like how to take care of it, um, like some of it's general, some of it's a bit specific, but it's, she mows like every two days. Do you have a neighbor like that? It, if she has the opportunity to mow every like one and a half days she does <laughs> but yeah um you do get some further reading material if you want to go further um but yeah it is if you do like books about specific gardens or specific places th this one really is something to have a look at and it's really interesting if you're like an or if you're just like a nature lover and like or like gardens or like want ideas of places to go um check this book out it's really interesting um so you get a wide variety of information um mainly about the gar the garden itself with um some plant and flower facts thrown in there so yeah nature into art happy readings